there, my name is Simbono, and welcome to Ori and the Blind Forest Definitive Edition, which I believe is just a couple extra things have been added to the actual game itself. From what I do know about this game, it's very, very story driven. Um, you play as a little creature dude, I don't, I, I apparently named Ori, and I don't really know what to do. I've watched a little bit of Jacksepticeye's video, that's what really got me interested in this game was the graphics of it, the orchestra stuff that I was hearing. I watched a little bit of Jacksepticeye's at one point, just a little bit of the gameplay, and I kind of liked what I was seeing, but I don't know anything about the story. So let's just quick make sure everything is what it, I want it to be. We'll mess with these later. Motion blur, might as well have that on. V-Sync is definitely going to be on. What is the contrast? Oh, okay. So if I do that... Let's just give it like that. Alright, let's start the game. Let's do normal. I'm gonna try and do voices. I think there's you can do little different voices and shit. Was the tr was that the tree talking? You know I'm not gonna try and do voices. I'm gonna try and keep the microphone away from me this time. So that is that Ori then? that swallow's nest listen to this music this is this looks absolute this looks absolutely gorgeous by the way I'm probably gonna be saying that a lot because when I see something that I really like I will continue to say the exact same thing I'm just gonna let the game do its thing. I'm gonna try and not talk a whole lot during this type of thing. So this must be Ori. So that creature that I just was was Naru. And I guess the tree was talking. Naru. What does the X's tell me? So this, from what I can see, it looks like it's going to be kind of a side-scrolling platformer. And also, based on what I saw from Jacksepticeye, just the few minutes that I did watch it. Wow, that's a lot of fruits. So Ori's just a kid then. This 
so cool, that voice. No, you gotta lose some weight, I think. Oh, shit's gone real. Did the forest die? I was gonna die, isn't she? Did you die? I already like you. How I'm sad. Damn, game, you just hit hard right off the bat, didn't you? So did she die of starvation or age or just because she might be part of the forest? you leave? I'd stay. I guess that kind of makes sense. Well, you know, or if you had stayed and eaten the rest of that fruit, you probably would be a little better right now.
I'm really sad right now. I'm really fucking sad. This is sad. I don't want to play this game anymore. I thought I was going to like this game. Gosh, yes, we know this is setting up a thing. And Ori's gonna collapse right on the edge of that, isn't she? Great! Game saved! You're just already ready to go, huh? Hold space. I'm working, I'm trying! There we go. Oh! I like the mouse, that's pretty neat. Oh, Jesus. Okay, then I died. Right, so let's go like this then. You found a small light spirit, small spirit light container. Spirit light has been added to your health, I'm assuming. Find more spirit light containers to quickly gain ability points. Okay. Hold S and press space to jump. Okay. Ow. Oh god, I'm so bad at this already. I have a feeling this game's gonna be mostly trial and error and shit like that. Found a life shard, collect these to restore your vitality. Ow. You found an energy cell. You can now collect and use more energy. Remember that you can use energy to create a soul link and save your game. Hold E to create a soul link. Okay. Oh god, that scared me. Oh god, I have two bars then. What's this thing down here doing? We're gonna let that grow a bit. 
I just want to see what it does. I don't know what that does. Okay. Is there a way to fight this? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I know. I know. I know. I know. You have to use this to break it. Suck it! Ooh. You found some spirit light. When you filled the thing, you gave it an ability point. Well, I haven't gained an ability point yet. Turning. I am sane, the light in the eyes of the spirit tree. I was lost in this glen when she loosened her grip. I can guide you on your journey if you allow me to come. Be still, can you hear that? They must have followed you here. Who's she and who are they? Okay, so I can kill shit. I gained an ability point. Create a soul link and tap E near it to access the thingy tree. Well, first I gotta kill this thing. Their light shall return to their lights shall return to me. These words the spirit tree once said. In the glade past the caverns, we'll find him. There's a path up ahead. What? I got one percent done. Now we get toggle. Player, objective, map, legend, control, shift to zoom, F. Yes, okay. Back. This bar, okay, so this is the ability tree. This bar indicates how much spirit light Ori collected. Absorb 39 more to gain another ability. not what I wanted to do. Shoot. Allows reusing soul links and shortens the cooldown timer. Oh, okay. So that circle is when I can then create a soul link, I guess. Spirit magnet. More pickups now float. Most pickups now float to Ori. Allows you to shoot three flames before recharging. Okay, I'm going to want him after that. After this. Wait, what did that say? Okay, then. How did- what did it say to toggle map? Tab is map. I gotta get up there, so I guess we have to go back. Up we get. There we go. You little shit! Oh, you done fucked up now with the stuff over here. I like the way Ori runs, though. It's pretty neat. So 
watch out there. Oh, nice. You can destroy this stuff. Okay. I want to know what this is first. Spirit wells are ancient structures that were used to quickly traverse all of Nibel. That must be the world we're in. The light of the spirit wells will also replenish your strength whenever you are weary. This gonna be a hard game, I think. Nothing in here. There's something up there. Shit. Okay, you can't carry so link on the the hell. Gained an ability point. Create a soul link and tap E near to access the ability tree. I want this. And then this just keeps going like this. Alright, so. And then it kind of just keeps building up from there. Gets to the point where it starts costing three, but for the most part, it's actually pretty easy to get. Oh, I can backflip. Damn, Ori is strong. There was something here. You found a keystone. Keystones are used to open spirit gates. Remember that each spirit gate will require a different number of keystones. Great! What the hell's a keystone? A thing. Oh, stop it. Fuck. Ooh. Okay, so that's the key. That's the, the spirit gate blocks us. They were built for protection before the days of decay. The required keystones must be right nearby. To reach the spirit tree, we must pass the spirit caverns that lie beyond this gate. Open! So I'm definitely going to want the other ability point. Okay, I can't reach that. I have to be able to jump higher, I think. Ow. Just out of curiosity. Okay, so that... Okay, so the, the yellow, I don't lose when I get hurt. But the green does kill me. I don't have the keystone anymore either. Ori's a tough little bastard, isn't she? Trying to be a Oh 
shit! I'm not good at this. I'm sorry, everybody. No, I need to quick check the ability tree, make sure I still have that, I still even have that ability. Good. I do. Okay. That's kind of what I was doing. I was going back and forth because I thought I knew, I thought I didn't have the ability anymore. I suppose it'll tell me. game is, I can already tell I'm gonna love this game. I'm gonna love this game. Because okay, so that, that thing shoots little projectiles. Let's go up here. You found an energy shard. Energy shards restore power to Ori's energy cells. I'm assuming that's this down here. Not powerful enough. Little shit. You found a life cell. You can now retain more vitality. Find more life cells to increase your survivability. So this is my health down here. Nice. I can't get up there, I don't think. Well, we're gonna go to the spear cabin. Tough little shits. kind of running around just collecting shit. I'm kind of getting used to the controls and everything. Ori, this is a map stone, one of the many ancient markers created to chart the forest of Nibel as it grew. There's a piece missing. If we can find the map stone fragment, we might be able to repair it. Okay. That's it right there. Oh, guess not. I'm trying to get up there. Look at me. I'm way the fuck down here. Let's get up there and then we'll end the video. Where that if I can get up there. Oh god, am I stuck? Alright, well we're gonna have to continue down here, I guess. I want that. I want! You know what? Fuck it! I just fucking lost everything.
Aha, I got it all. I want that now. Who's that? When who ravaged and killed? The light of the spirit tree lives in all of us. He is the reason we're alive. He's the reason we grew. When he called out to find you many years past, we were attacked, wounded, and killed by our foe. Now these ancestral trees are all that's left behind. Come closer now and feel the light of fill the spirit inside. You've learned wall jump! To use this ability, push the block the arrows towards the wall and press space continuously to leap upward. That's kinda nice. You found an energy cell, you can now collect and use more energy. Remember that you can use energy to create a soul link and save the game. So what's the story here? Ow. Can't kill those. So Still trying to figure out Stone. Good. Still, I still have to get up there somehow. And then there's a the map in here. Oh God! Fuck! I died. Well, I thought we were gonna end it here. Well, just because of how long this is getting, we're gonna leave it there and I'll continue going on next time.
I, I'd like to do longer videos, but because of my Wi-Fi, I can't do a whole lot more than a half hour or 40 minutes, provided I don't do a whole lot of editing. And this particular episode is actually probably going to do a few more edits than I would like. Because the more edits I do, the larger the video file actually becomes, which is weird, but that's just how it has to be, I guess. And with my Wi-Fi, I, it takes 6 to 8 to 12 hours, depending on the size of the video. And um, this is starting to get pretty big, so I have to end it here. So we'll continue on next time. So thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, please smash the like button down below. Leave a comment down below what you want to see next. I'll tell you what you thought of this episode of Ori and the Blind Forest. And tell me what you think of the game. And if you think it's going to be a good game or anything. Because I don't know. Please don't spoil anything. Cleo, do not come up here. My cat is behind the camera right now. Anyways, thank you guys so much. I will see you, that see you next time. Take care now. Bye-bye. Oh, oh, I forgot. In, in episode 2, I put a, a scene where Michael Jackson is in the scene. <laughs> Michael Jackson! Michael J. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually because I made that song. It is enough. I'm